Mixed reactions has trailed the suspension of the Minister for Humanitarian Affairs and Poverty Elevation, Beta Edu, over an alleged 585 million naira scandal. Some Nigerians are expressing diverse opinions on the suspension with debates over our innocence until proven guilty and commendation for the president's decisive action. President Bola Tinubu took the bold step on Monday, suspending Beta and ordering a comprehensive inquiry into the alleged 585 million naira scandal within the Federal Ministry of Humanitarian Affairs and Poverty Elevation. Uh, to my own view, and what I look at in that side is that it's not, I would say in one face, it's not proper. But in another face, we have to look at it that is, is it something that has been happening in uh, previous uh, times and uh, have the definition be given to us that uh, it should not be done? Yes. Well, what me I'm looking at now is that um, we won't totally say uh, is a bad thing, but what I would say is that is wrong if that phone is transferred into those accounts and we cannot trace it. And before we've heard that some government officials have been doing it and doing the project and completing it. So that is what we have, first of all, have to judge. Based on the recent uh, incident that happened about the humanitarian minister, I mean, uh, transferring a fund to a private uh, entity is, to me, I don't know, it's, it's, it's not right because this is a government fund and what is meant for, what is meant for public. So it should be transferred to a public fund. Those funds that are being transferred should be monitored on, on what basis. But I mean, uh, sh I mean, ar arresting her too, you have to carry out investigation because uh, sometimes, uh, you know, those cabal, they want to have their own. This one have to, want to have their own. Maybe to, to safeguard the, the money and to use it on appropriate, uh, I mean, uh, constituency, may, maybe for this alleviating, uh, I mean, a uh, problem of hardship. Okay. So if the proper investigation is being carried out and seen that what she, her intention was not meant to, to use for personal use, then uh, she, 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 she is right. But at the same time, if, if it's fine that uh, those money was, was not really a uh, portion to what it's meant to do, then uh, I mean, the appropriate discipline should be, should be applied. I, I don't want to comment as to whether a person has done a crime or not. I think that's subject to the findings of the authorities th themselves. But obviously, um, accountability is key. I mean, the, you know, the quality of uh, governance uh, is, is based on the accountability of its officials. So uh, it's encouraging to see that government is now questioning people for their actions. You know, whether it's financial or whatever powers vested in them, this is a trust. So I believe. Uh, such an action by the current president you know, they are, is something that is commendable and they should continue to insist that people they should account for their actions and that is a, it is a trust you know vested in them uh, into the president and then transferred to them and so uh, it's obviously uh, a welcome development hello hope you enjoyed the news please do subscribe to our youtube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates